Hello YouTube, this is Bowtie Media, and today we've got a brand new reaction to Infected Mushrooms Black Velvet featuring uh, Nanette Tayeb. I think I butchered that horribly, but that's besides the point. We've got an instinct track from uh, from Infected Mushroom here on Monster Cat. For those of you that are not familiar, Monster Cat is into three different uh, sub-labels, kind of sub-brands uh, of Silk Instinct and Uncaged, and they've always pretty much always been on Uncaged before. They had kind of heavier style music, and this is not, apparently. This is a lighter side. This is a more uh, brighter, happier, in theory, track. Um, we'll, we'll see what it actually ends up being. Uh, I'm trying to look real quickly what, uh, it, it's labeled as electronic, which is normally just their umbrella term for a song that they don't know what to label as, so they just call it electronic, but, uh, I am intrigued to see what this is going to be. I guess it's not Psytrance, um, because it would be labeled Psytrance. So, uh, here we go. This is Black Velvet by Infected Mushroom. Very interesting start.
Wow. Okay, that is by far, by far the most <laughs> uh, unique song on Monster Cat. I think, with even without a doubt, like, wow. So I'm trying to think of some other tracks. So I'm thinking of the experimental or songs that like kind of feel the most, the least like Monster Cat. And I think of like Karma Fields in early days, even though that was still very much electronic. Like, I don't even know what this is. Um, this is like a mix of like, it sounds a little country, a little rock and roll with a little bit of the hit of that electronic sound. Uh, there's no like drop. It's just a chorus. It is, this is honestly one of the most unique Monster Cat songs I have ever heard. Um, and by that, I mean, I literally listened to every single Monster Cat song that's existed. Um, so I think this, this may take the cake, in my opinion, at least for the most unique song on Monster Cat just how different it is from everything else. And I mean, if there's anyone who's going to do it, it's going to be Infected Mushroom uh, because they're already unique as it is, uh, adding some way different sounds to what we normally hear. I guess they're the only ones really doing side trance on Monster Gap. But wow, that, um, that was so unique. Uh, <laughs> I don't even know what to say about it. The, the vocals were not bad. It just sounded like, I don't know, it sounded like a song I would hear on like a Southern like radio station, like American Southern, like, a, like, a, I don't know. That was just, that was so strange to me. I really don't know how to feel about it. I really don't. It's not, I will say it's not my style. It's not my style off the bat. Um, it's not something that I particularly, uh, a, st a sound I would subscribe to. Uh, but I don't know. It's man, I don't even know what to say about it. This is just so, this has caught me in such a loop because, not a loop, I just, I don't know what to say. I genuinely, I want to try to give, I want to do these videos, I, I want to try to give real good analysis on the stuff, but I genuinely am lost for words. I don't, all I can say is that it's unique and I'm, I am just shocked. There's this kind of song, I don't know. I don't know. I, I'm interested to know, but for those of you that love Infected Mushroom, I like Infected Mushroom, I don't like love Infected Mushroom, I think your stuff's pretty good. Um, what is this? How how do you, what, what do you think of this track? Is this like, oh my gosh, this is so far in the opposite direction when I expected I don't like it, or it's like, oh my gosh, I actually love this, this is amazing. I would love to know, um, honestly, any and all thoughts in the comment section below. I gotta end the video here. I, I don't know how I feel about this, so I need to circle back at some point. Um, it's just so, so weird. Is that the Cookies from Space background too? Um, it looks like there's a bit of the, the, like the saucer and the cookies from space in the back. It looks like maybe it's a little Easter egg of the album art, but, uh, okay. Uh, that was, uh, <laughs> that was my thoughts, initial reaction to Black Velvet by Infected Mushroom. Uh, let me know. Yeah. Again, everything in the comments below. I'm Bowtie Media and I'll see you guys in another video.